So, <clears throat> long time no video. I thought I'd uh, make a quick uh, tutorial of uh, uh, how I achieved this uh, blue greenish effect on my custodes. Uh, I'm working on two Palace Grav attack vehicles. And uh, for starters, I primed everything black. And now with my Sotar 2020 and some Liquitex acrylic uh, ink, uh, I am doing a, a pre-highlight of uh, white on the on the panels that I, I I want to get this blue green effect. So going mostly air and very little ink through the airbrush and the ink I thin down with uh, Vallejo airbrush uh, thinner and actually maybe half and half and so it runs quite smoothly but you do many layers and let the white build up Uh, if idea of this effect would be then the in the end result is a nice little bit lighter blue green on top and then a little bit darker in the bottom so one side done and shift over to the other the idea is of course also to get the highlight approximately the into the same place on different sides of this uh, uh, panel sorry if it shakes a little bit we have a bit of a storm going on outside i am as usual working on board the ship I have here a uh, uh, reference point is this uh, bit here and uh, there's another one on the other side so I more or less know how far down I want to go with the white similar effect you could do with, um, say if you want to do a classic uh, uh, color combinations for these uh, custodes tanks is let's say gold and uh, candy apple red achieved with uh, Tamiya clear red but then you do the base you do silver with uh, let's say a uh, gunmetal base and then uh, steel or aluminium highlight approximately in the same place as I am doing this white ink and uh, and uh, that's how you achieve the effect. Now let's put this on the tank. Uh, I'm checking that uh, both of them are more or less the same and also more or less even this side needs a little bit more to be more uniform okay I will stop here and uh, change out my colors and then get back to you so test number three had a slight uh, uh, 
camera accident and uh, so what we do we took some uh, uh, scale 75 fantasy and game range Haldra blue and uh, we made a quite a thin mix with uh, flow improver and airbrush thinner uh, so it's quite a watery consistency and we are applying just a film uh, of paint over this uh, panel and we try to have it as even and smooth as possible and with this what we can do is uh, of course the more we add the more layers we add the more it opaque it will get this is when it's still wet and this is when it started to dry again so let's do the other panel as well See, uh, add the pieces to the hull of the tank. That's why I uh, pinned the uh, uh, pods uh, so I can easily airbrush and get access to the whole model uh, while at the same time uh, I can look how it looks when it's set together. And here is the one I did before. And these will get uh, gold trim and engines will get uh, painted silver and then I will try out some oil washing and uh, some other techniques maybe more that I haven't done before thank you for watching this is Flooney sharing uh, videos from the high seas and uh, hope to hear from you next time.